Hi there, Sandile here. The guy who lives on top of the hill and gardens on top of the hill. A um, couple of weeks back or months back, yeah, I think it must be a couple of months back, I had uh, potatoes um, planted in my um, containers or I call them um, buckets. They're not really buckets, yeah. Anyway, you, you'll get the point as soon as you see them. Uh, and I think now I'm going to have a look and see what I will get out of them. I did open one of them uh, last week, if not a week before last. And I got a, a few nice chunky potatoes. Uh, so I'm not sure what I am going to get on these ones. But I am going to open them and see let's do that these are the two buckets i'm talking about or containers i'm talking about as you can see the plants are almost uh, dying you know they have uh, some yellow leaves and all that so i thought you know what i'm not gonna i'm not going to wait for them to die i am just going to flip them and and see what's in there you know maybe it will be something worth a while maybe it will be something not worth a while but yeah this is how i grow my potatoes and uh, my sweet potatoes but for sweet potatoes i'm using bigger containers than these ones uh, because you know yeah those guys need a lot of space to grow so let's let's have a look and see you know uh, we might not get much you know um given also the fact that uh, when i planted these guys i did not use um you know seed potatoes to plant them i actually took some of the potatoes that were already growing shoot inside the house and then i just chucked them in there so sometimes they rot you know and you don't get anything because they're not seed potatoes or if they don't rot they grow a plant and that plant um, does not have enough energy or food from the actual potato that i'm putting in there to grow and produce um uh, another set of uh, potatoes so yeah so we will see though let's let's have a look let's have a look you see this is the this is the original potato this is the original potato that i had put in here so from the house that was starting to 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 rot or to grow shoots so yeah well here we go one uh, two uh, not so big not so big you know not so big they're quite very very tiny i must say you know they are not that big from this bucket um yeah they, they quite very small maybe i opened it too early you know but what i've discovered also previously is um because i have waited before just a little bit longer and what had happened is that the actual uh, potatoes that were in the container because i had left them for that lo for a longer time um, hoping for them to grow just a little bit more they actually started rotting <laughs> you know so yeah it's a it's a bit of a yeah a tricky one to to balance well for me i'm no expect no in growing potatoes or in growing anything whatsoever so yeah but um it, it is yeah obviously interesting for me though to to see 
you know um how much i will get and you know what i get given the the facts that i've pointed out that you know there are potatoes that uh, you buy which are seed potatoes and those they will give you quite a chunky huge potatoes and a lot of yield as well because that's what they are meant for so out of this packet this is what we got you know yeah this is what we got out of this packet uh well they are they will be eatable not so much bigger not a lot but from one single potato we got quite a few let's put that on the side and let's chop this guy out and, uh, uh, and see i love pulling the weeds out uh, weeds because i i will recycle this soil so yeah anyway all right let's go off you go there we go this guy's out uh okay push it there oh these are looking beautiful these are looking beautiful they are looking beautiful oh god get that i'm sure they are even soft and uh, yummy you know okay okay you know maybe put some of these plants back and see if they will even grow anything yeah you can see also here here's the skin for the original one that i had planted you know yeah Let's put there. there we go there we go oh look at that one that's fairly uh, okay not so big but fairly okay i would say yeah oh my boy what are you carrying hope you were not hitting my car with those things no 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 don't do that no uh -uh. no 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 papa um okay yeah uh, they're looking quite um beautiful these ones these ones are looking beautiful ah uh, look at that yeah the soil i've explained before on, a, on another video how i make my my soil that i plant on if you're wondering how it is so easy that i just break it you know with my hand it doesn't take even much of an effort and you can also see if you look there's chunks of wood and all that because it's um oh here is the original guy yeah it's the original guy yeah okay uh, yeah. okay i don't think there is anymore we can check oh there whoa look at that ah, okay that's why it's important to double check you know and uh, make sure that you've taken everything out you know before you throw your good food away okay i think that's about it i don't think there is more okay now let's have a, a look this bucket looks much much more better than this one you know and <laughs> funny enough also these ones look quite more cleaner than these ones these ones look a little bit dirty but uh yeah let's 
put all of them in there give them a wash and take them inside the house right yeah that's um how i grow my potatoes and um you know if um you wanna grow your own yeah just get these guys or oh, an old bucket that um that is that has a hole or that's leaking or that's you don't need anymore you won't use anymore and then drill some holes open it up and uh yes and you can have it uh filled up with soil and you grow your your potatoes and yeah and you grow your potatoes that you can enjoy with your family and and your friends if you want to share them with your friends you know so yeah it's not a lot as in like tons tons but it is enough for me and my family and yeah i'm grateful to nature right guys you've seen how i do this you know now that it's possible that you can also do it so get out there do it get food secured and enjoy food that you grow on your own backyard and on your own yard without much problems okay yeah uh, if uh, you have comments contributions questions whatsoever leave a comment below i'll do my best to get back to you uh if it's a question if it's a comment i'll still give you a thumbs up to show my appreciation um yeah I, like i always say i'm no expert i'm just a a fund a learner that's always learning and growing in this thing called gardening or farming whatever you want to call it yeah so and i love sharing my own experiences with everyone so that everyone can uh, learn from what i've learned okay guys sandile here guy who lives on top of the hill and gardens on top of the hill i'm out